Hey everyone, Joel Lance here. Today we're at Daddy O's Irish Ice Cream Pub. Yes, you heard that right, Irish Ice Cream Pub. So this is a place that specializes in alcoholic ice cream. Pretty interesting, pretty interesting. So basically today we have a big shepherd's pie, which is like a number of shepherd's pie. It's like five of the shepherd's pie, I believe. And then we have a big ice cream dish, which they call the mother load, which is like a big ice cream. So we have like a massive shepherd's pie, a massive ice cream, all in one combination. So that's pretty cool. You know, kind of an like Irish combination, hence Irish ice cream pub. We're getting the Irish pub, we're getting the ice cream, and so on and so forth. So this challenge room is for Randy Santalamos here with Rena Huang. So yeah, it's gonna be really fun. Always so great to meet up with these individuals. So yeah, this will be a very interesting challenge, ice cream and shepherd's pie. So it should be good. I'll get you some more details here momentarily. It's also in collaboration with Legend which is a local uh, distillery. Uh, they have some of their, I guess, alcohols and spirits in some of the ice cream. So we'll see what happens, we'll have some fun, and let's go eat some ice cream and shepherd's pie. Hey everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall win number 891. It is my third challenge in a row with these fine people. I've already had them introduce themselves in the last two, so I'll do it today, but we've got Raina Wong from California, and then from Canada, what part of Canada? I currently live in Ontario. Yes, we've got Mr. Joel Hansen, or Model versus Food. We are all in Sugar Hill, Georgia, which is to the northeast of Atlanta. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. We are at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub. We're the first three people to take on Daddy O'Brien's Shepherd's Pie Challenge. We're the first to take on this. We're gonna start with all of this food here first, then they're gonna bring out our ice creams. Daddy O'Brien's here, they're known for their actually alcohol infused ice cream. I think it'll be my first time trying that, but we've got 30 minutes to finish all of this, plus the ice cream, which is gonna be 12 scoops. We'll explain that in a little bit, but we've got five portions each of their shepherd's pie, which is made with beef, but we've got, I think, corn on the bottom. There's some garlic mashed potatoes. There is beef, and then it's all topped with a whole bunch of cheese. Uh, put in the oven, baked, looks amazing. And then we each have five portions of their green beans. So we're gonna start with these. If we fail this entire challenge, it's gonna be $85. But if we win, we'll get our meals free. We'll get sweet t-shirts to add to our collections. We'll get Daddy O'Brien's souvenir mugs to take home. And we're hoping to be the first three people up on the wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. <laughs> All right, big thank you to Daddy-O and Mommy-O here at Daddy O'Brien's in Sugar Hill, Georgia. But we've got 30 minutes to finish. We're all gonna have to hurry through this because I think there's like two and a half pounds of ice cream, but six of the scoops, I think for Joel six, all 12 for me, are infused with alcohol. But two of them, there's gonna be three flavors of each. We each got four, I think, different flavors, but there's gonna be Legends Distillery products, a vodka and a bourbon, and those, we'll have Chris from Legends Distillery explain that while we are eating. But let's shut up and eat, Dominic. One, two, three. Boom! All right. All of this shepherd's pie is about three pounds total. Oh, Delicious, wow. healthy gravy. Holy crap. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> She's back with a vengeance after last night's challenge. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, she's on page one. She's coming through. Oh, yeah, get it ready. She's killing This is stupid good. Mm -hmm. It is very good. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub in Sugar Hill, Georgia, which is kind of in the Atlanta area. I'm taking on this awesome, delicious food challenge uh, with a whole bunch of shepherd's pie, which was actually made with a beef pot roast. Um, then we had green beans and we had uh, ice cream, which was to come. They were keeping the ice cream like in the freezer because they were making sure it didn't melt at all before we actually got it. So we had to finish this part of the challenge, AKA the shepherd's pie, before we could actually even get the ice cream on the table. We're a minute and a half in. Raina is dominating. Good job, Raina. But I forgot. It is beef, but it's actually pot roast. 
uh, in all these shepherd's pies. It's amazing. Very delicious. It was pretty funny, and you can see the surprise on Randy's uh, face and verbally um, at the start of this challenge because we all like talked before we started. We're like, "All right, how fast are we going?" We're all like, "Okay, we're just gonna go like at a re reasonable, relaxed speed." And then Raina, you know, just started gunning it out the bat, which was pretty funny. So uh, definitely caught us off guard. But I guess she just must have really liked the shepherd's pie and or wanted to get to her ice cream um, which I was super excited to get to the ice cream although the shepherd's pie was so good I just had to like you know enjoy it savor it and uh, I mean hey two minutes and 18 seconds for her to finish all that that's awesome good job Raina thank you that was really good Top comes the ice cream so the ice cream dish which was in the challenge is called the mother load so it's basically a 12 scoop ice cream sundae and then it has like all the toppings on top of it and a piece of cake underneath um, the cake has a very very special history um, which i will mention here it'll come up in the video momentarily um, but we each had about four ish flavors of ice cream all all the ice creams are made in house um, i and randy we chose some of the flavors with uh, liqueur in them, whereas Reyna did not. Delicious flavor. Delicious flavors that I am savoring and enjoying. This ice cream? Oh my god. Oh my god. The best thing ever. I can't eat ice cream. They've been touring together, so Joel knew this was going to happen, all part of his strategy. <laughs> Randy actually knows. Uh, yes, Mommy O is actually going to come over here and explain the flavors that Raina got and then the flavors that Joel got. I just had that bourbon. Raina has <laughs> vanilla, cotton candy, strawberry, and I forget one more. Um, I don't know what else I Butterbeer, he has the Legends Bourbon, and the, um, oh, Koki Butter Pecan, one of my favorites. Uh, and then at the bottom is a piece of Amari's homemade chocolate cake, and all of our toppings. He's got two sets of alcoholic and two sets of non? Yes. Yes, okay. And then all mine are alcoholic. That's going to be coming in a little bit. <laughs> That's not saying Randy is an alcoholic. <laughs> he just has the alcoholic ice cream. Mm. Damn, this ice cream is so good. We are at an Irish place, so we've got to have some alcohol. Can we get seconds too? Followed by a Guinness after. Keep in mind, we're only four minutes and 50 seconds in. Hey. I can't speak for the others, but obviously I was not trying to race, especially when it came to this ice cream. It was just, it really was so phenomenal. Like, I cannot stress enough. The, it was so, oh, just the flavors. Like, literally the best ice cream I've ever had. And who would have thought that I'd be having it at what is, you know, an Irish ice cream pub? Um, so definitely if you're ever in the Atlanta area, especially in the Sugar Hill area, I definitely recommend coming by and trying some of their ice cream. They have a whole bunch of alcoholic flavors, which is very unique in itself. I've never had alcoholic ice cream before. Um, but even the non-alcoholic stuff was just like out of this world. Absolutely, absolutely loved it. Um, so definitely need to check that out. 
Um, so yeah, basically that was about it. We had 30 minutes to do this challenge. Um, hopefully we're going to complete it. We'll be the first ones to do so. Hopefully in that case we get it for free, get a free t-shirt. Um, pretty standard. But thanks so much for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the rest of this video. I'll let you get to it. Definitely a cool one. Again, Irish shepherd's pie and or delicious ice cream. Very delicious ice cream. Like, ugh, like I said, I, I can't say enough. So enjoy the rest of the video everybody. Let's see what happens. Hopefully get some wins and let's eat some ice cream. So the cake is a 100 year old recipe. Ice cream dominant here by a grandmaster of ice cream making. I'm in love. I'm love. It's just too good. Second will come. Joel is. Ah. Seven minutes and 38 seconds for all of mine. About to make the switcheroo and not knock out Raina. There we go. All right, and then Joel is just finishing up. Let's go, Joel. I wasn't involved with the topping picks, but whoever picked them, I think it was Joel, did great. This is awesome. There's even Lucky Charm Marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> that is near and dear to my heart, guys. Near and dear to my heart. <laughs> they are magically delicious. <laughs> I am after their Lucky Charms, I'll tell you that. We have a Lucky Charms ice cream. We're 12 minutes and 35 seconds in. Guys, groundbreaking. Lucky Charms ice cream. Okay. <laughs> Remember that seconds I talked about? He didn't have like four churros after the uh, Mexican food challenge the other day. Two. Moderate. <laughs> <laughs> Do you use the van for anything or is it just delivery? Um, well, to drive back and forth. <laughs> Raina, how are you doing? Cool. 14 minutes in. Go right cold. Up. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, Raina. 
Brandon and I are cold and Randy's sweating. I'm not sure what's going on in here, but somebody is I weigh more than both of them, don't I? <laughs> somebody, somebody isn't eating their ice cream fast enough, I think so it is. Fifteen minutes in, halfway through, Chris with Legends Distillery is going to come over and help explain the vodka and the bourbon that we're eating in this ice cream. So we're at a distillery down the road in Cumming, Georgia, and we make award-winning vodka and bourbon. We actually launched our brand in March of this year. We've been around since 2007, but the Legends brand is brand new to us. We have a patented technology called Quantum Purity, and what it does is it reduces the congeners in alcohol leads, which is the toxins by 50%. So you get the full flavor of the vodka and the bourbon, but we're reducing the top to give you a hangover. There's no burn with our product at all. It is ultra smooth, ultra pure. We won the 2019 Vodka of the Year Award, and we just won on our 100 proof bourbon, the best of class platinum of the SIP Awards, which is huge for us. Nice job. Combined with this ice cream, it is delicious. And Daddy O sells it. You know, they sell it here. They do the 87, which is a single barrel bourbon. And they sell our vodka here. Uh, they do delicious cocktails uh, as well as shots. We recommend the shot because it is so smooth. You'd be shocked that there is no bourbon whatsoever with us there. So please enjoy the ice cream. They make a delicious bread pudding with our bourbon. It we'll see how I feel tomorrow, whether he's right or wrong. <laughs> no hangover. <laughs> He's gonna take back the morning. That's all okay, the Hey, there you go. The there you go. Well, hey, thanks for being here. We appreciate it. Fifty percent less toxins, less mouth burn, full feeling, and full delicious. That's all I have right now. This stuff Good. kicks. Leaving no doubt. They said getting all alcohol infused ice cream would take longer, and they were right. <laughs> and I did make that up. As Joel always says, leave no doubt. Second to number three time for Daddy O'Brien's challenge here at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub here in Sugar Hill, Georgia. Thank you guys all for being here. I think all three of us really enjoyed the cake that was in this thing. Along with, I've got to say my favorite part was that shepherd's pie. Loved it. Every part of that, the pot roast in there, the cheese on top, the garlic mashed potatoes, Really enjoyable meal, and then we got all that fiber and the vitamins and minerals in those healthy green beans. But yeah, delicious meal. So we are each going to get the $85 meals for free. If you want to take on this mother load challenge, it's 25 bucks, and then 60 of it came from all of the shepherd's pie and the green beans. But we're gonna get our meals free. We're gonna get sweet t-shirts, dead dark collections, and we'll be the very first three people up on the wall of fame for beating this challenge. So big thank you to Mommy O and Daddy O here at Daddy O'Brien's Irish Ice Cream Pub in Sugar Hill, Georgia. For me, it was overall win number 891, one of many for Raina, and then number 214 for me. Yes, so this was my third and final challenge with them, so thanks to them for doing the challenge. I think they head back home this weekend, but thank you guys for watching. And with Randy doing the outro, I kind of forgot to do uh, an outro myself. But anyway, huge thank you to Mamio, Daddio, they're the owners there, plus all the other staff. Excellent place, seriously, the best ice cream I've ever had in my life. Um, not just the alcoholic ones, but like the non alcoholic ones. The flavors are exceptional. I got to try a couple more after, just it was fantastic. Um, a huge thanks to everybody who came out and watched. 
a uh, huge thanks to you for watching today. Uh, but seriously, great crowd, great place, great people, very much loved, uh, you know, Atlanta, Georgia, um, up in that area. So that everybody, until next time, say happy the hungry, happy eating, of course, you know, just have a lovely night, have a lovely night, peace out. And here we have, here is a Georgia Atlanta squirrel. This is a Georgia squirrel. They're very thick, thick squirrels here in Georgia. Hello, Georgia squirrel. How you doing, buddy? Big, thick things. Look how thick this puppy is. Big, thick puppy. All the way from Atlanta, Georgia. A thick pup. Good puppy. Thick Georgia squirrel. Five C's, at least. At least.